of yesterday's action, here's a visual stroll down memory lane, a compilation of all the world's cla world class plays from Monday's five Group B matches. Day two of the Season 3 World Championship was all about the unpredictability of Group B. In the first game of the day, Samsung Galaxy Ozone flexed their muscles against the overmatched Mineski. Here comes the stand, United Dandy, board, very low on mana. He's going to be staying on the outside. Mata goes in for the ultimate. He is focused out very fast. They're looking at Yume now. Eyes onto him. He takes the lantern home. And that is just them flexing their muscles right now. But Mineski would not go down without a fight. Looper coming in with the ultimate. Tries to get Exo so the damage can't be done. Kiting very well. Blade of the Root can keeping Exo alive in the fight. And holy Crap, but Nesky comes up huge! Nice one. Nice one. In the end, Samsung were too strong, and the win improves their group record to 2-1. and one. Expect that hammer to be dropped, and it looks like they get up a nice pad on the KDA before they take down the Nexus turrets. Ozone coming into this one quite strong. The fight didn't put him on tilt. They knew what they needed to do. Yeah, you can see a fairly calm and collected Ozone right there. In their match against Gambit, Vulcan made one mistake after another. Level 4 to 4, they're going to Diamond! Could it be first blood? He pulls himself out just on the outside! It wasn't the Q! Psycho Zip couldn't hit it! The kill goes out! First blood going over to Voidal! And Genja gets the second one! Gambit punished Vulcan for those missteps, and they continue to roll through Group B. The Smithy may go down there. Oh, they throw the Command Shockwave! That was quite unfortunate on the Ball Breaker. He connects with it, and he kicks it back! Nice! Gambit, 3-0 here in Group B. Gambit absolutely dominating this group so far. In the third game of the day, Fnatic exploded Samsung Ozone's bot lane. Cyanide as well comes into the fight, and they will be able to get this down. Oh. Very low. Looper is just getting crushed. A great ultimate coming in from Soaz, and they obliterate the bottom lane with four members. And that's the dive from Fnatic. Fnatic dominated the Korean Ozone, and the win would give Europe the top two spots in Group B. This is the decider now. Puja going in. He gets hit up, but he's already taken down Dade. They turn the fight around to him. So has his 1v1 as well in the fight against Dandy. And the Fnatic takes the jungle back. And you cannot run from this Fnatic team. They chase everyone down on Ozo. 21 kills to 6. And another surrender from Ozo. Two teams in need of a win played a very close game until 30 minutes when Vulcan was able to pull away for the win to keep pace with the Group B leaders. Finally Vulcan's starting to turn the screws on the Philippine team and it's going to be Yume backing off. Exo gets caught out, Wither comes in, Vulcan closing the door, they do manage to get one. Yume's not going to be able to survive another though and that surely will be the game for Vulcan. And the crowd chanting USA in the background, happy to have their hometown team pick up a win right here. Hard fought victory, the book has done it. The last game of the day was perhaps the most important. Gambit were looking to remain undefeated, while Fnatic were trying to snap Gambit's three game winning streak to move into a tie for first in the group standings. But it's the damage for Fnatic that's doing the job. They get one, get two, get on towards Diamond, they get the slow on him. Soaz comes bouncing on in there, and Cyanide should finish this one out. It will be another kill. That is a three for zero exchange. Fnatic looking strong. The early deficit would force Gambit to gamble for Baron. It's gonna be close. We can fight them. We can fight. We can fight. We can fight. It's slow. We can fight. Fight them. Fight them. Yeah. Cyanide goes in. He's gonna get locked up. That's Gambit picking up one kill. So has the target. Passive not available. Solar Flare finds his target. That's gonna be another kill for Push. You getting on towards him. Gambit taken so, so low. Having to back out the side. Diamond goes down. Genja gets away with it. But it's another kill for Push. That was a three for one. The score says it all, ladies and gentlemen. 21 kills to three. They looked invincible, but wow, they've just been swept aside by Fnatic.